Okay, my friends, I want to show you the best way to track military aircraft on the web because Flight Radar 24 isn't actually the best website. The best website is here, ADBS, ADSB Exchange. Okay, so if you just Google ADSB, then you'll get it. So ADSBExchange.com. Uh, this is the source of a lot of data. So this is actually the data that Flight Radar uses. Now, go here to Filters. See that? And you got a military button right there. And then you hit the button Filter. And there you go, all of the military aircraft. And that's much more aircraft than are being shown in Flight Radar. So if we go over, check it out. There, here's an A400M flying over Hanover, okay? If we go over to Flight Radar 24, let's see if we can see him. A400. First of all, we this. Go by type. A400. And you don't see him, do you? Okay, let's try just A4. A4. So, we still don't see the A400M over Hanover, see, because Flight Radar is not the best site to track military planes. However, we do see an A4 Skyhawk here, the Don Douglas A4N Skyhawk, and these guys are usually flying around doing uh, training. I can't believe that this is an active military plane. Usually they show you they're in the Skyhawk training squadron. Interesting though, this guy's from Canada. So, as you can see, this A400M, which is in the ADSB exchange, is not being shown. Let's see if that A400M is here. Hmm. You see, because this is not a real military flight, is it? It's an A4 Skyhawk but it's not marked as military. Interesting. So what's this? Probably the PCT-135 Dornier. Interesting. So as you can see, my friends, if you want to see military aircraft, go to the ADBSB Exchange or just Google ADSB and go to Filters here. Oops, right there, Filters and you can filter by military much easier and you'll see many more military aircraft than in flight radar 24. c-130 hercules let's see if we got the dope oh, is that our good old uav yeah that is a q4 so that is the what you call it the q4 reaper so now we can go in here take this filter out and we can put Q4 in here and that should show us the same Reaper. Where was he? You see, there he is way over here. This is the MQ4, no, was it Reaper? Uh, this one's called the Phoenix. It's not a Global Hawk, but the the Northrop Grumman RQ-4D Phoenix is the European version of the Global Hawk. Okay, and uh, interesting. This one's from Italy. And so as you can see, flight radar is nicer. It looks better. However, it doesn't have all the aircraft that the ADSB Exchange has. So... You can do the same thing here, and you get all of this, this information over here. And you can also play with the looks. The other problem with this website is it doesn't have a good mobile version. I'll show you that in another video. So go to the ADSB Exchange. Check out all of the military aircraft filter by military right here. And when you, you, you find them, you can use these codes to use in flight radar. Oh, here's a, a tanker circling around Poland. 
right near the Ukrainian border. What do you think this tanker is doing? Where are all the aircraft that it's refueling? Remember, only military aircraft that have their ADSB transponder on are shown. So these guys choose to be shown to the public, okay? You're not seeing all of the actual military aircraft that are actually flying. This guy here is flying around for a reason. He's refueling fighter aircraft that are ready to pounce in the Ukraine on, uh, well, probably Russian aircraft or who knows what, you know? All right, my friends, if you like that video, give it a thumbs up.